Back in November, one of the closely watched races in our area was Oregon's 5th Congressional District. It was a Democratic stronghold for two decades, with the boundaries redrawn in 2010 and 2020. The last Republican to win the district was Jim Bunn in the mid-1990s. Then, Democrat Darlene Hooley held the seat from 97 to 2009 before retiring. Kurt Schrader was there until he was ousted by Jamie McLeod Skinner in the Democratic primary last year. That led to a showdown between McLeod Skinner and Republican Lori Chavez de Reamer, who previously ran two unsuccessful bids for an Oregon State House seat in 2016 and 2018. And in one of the bigger surprises in the last election, Chavez de Reamer flipped the district to red. It was a fairly close race with the candidates separated by 7,000 votes. So maybe it should come as no surprise that the 5th Congressional District is one the Democrats would really like to have back. And this week, a big name in local politics threw her hat into the ring to try to do just that. Metro President Lynn Peterson announced her campaign yesterday looking to unseat Chavez de Reamer during the November 2024 election. In a statement, Peterson's camp says she's running to ease the burden on families and communities struggling with rising costs, as well as concerns about wildfires and air quality. Peterson added, Congress is not doing its part. Ideological politicians are more intent on culture wars than helping working people, more interested in rolling back fundamental rights than protecting our small cities and rural communities. She's obviously no stranger to politics, winning each one of her five campaigns for local and regional office. But the fact that she's announcing her campaign now, 17 months before the election for the 5th Congressional District seat, well, that tells us the race will once again be hotly contested. Republicans hold a 10 seat majority in the U.S. House, so it's important. Just hours after Peterson's announcement, the chair of the Oregon GOP released a statement of his own. Justin Wong urged Republicans to re-elect Chavez de Reamer, writing of Peterson, her alignment with the far left policies and initiatives demonstrates a disregard for the principles of fiscal responsibility, limited government and personal liberty that our constituents hold dear. We have a long way to go before November 5th, 2024. But the race for Oregon's 5th Congressional District is already one that we are keeping an eye on. And you should too.